Hi, this is Vil Ramos. Thanks for watching my channel. In this video, I want to show you how I caught my first flounder. The rig I'm using has Berkeley Gulp artificial sandworms on them. They're scented with something to attract the fish. I've attached one sandworm to a bucktail to act as the weight for the rig, and a second worm on a flounder hook. Uh, flounder hooks are long and narrow hooks. Um, the flounder have narrow mouths, so you need a narrow hook that they can swallow. And uh, once you feel a bite, you wait a few seconds so that they can swallow the hook, and then you set it. I've read that flounder are flat fish, and they like to hide in the sand and camouflage themselves using the color of their top body to hide themselves, and then they attack prey that are unsuspecting. So what I'm doing is I'm casting out and reeling the rig slowly, hoping that the weight of the bucktail will bring the rig um, right at the surface of the sand without catching any seaweed. Uh, as I'm reeling it in, I'm jigging the fishing rod up and down to attract the fish. Lucky for me, I was able to catch my first flounder today. I felt a little nibble, waited a few seconds, then I set the hook. And here's the footage of me bringing it in. As you can see, the fish attacked the uh, flounder hook, which was the long, uh, narrow hook that I described. And the bucktail um, may have helped to attract it by uh, catching its attention, but it did not bite the bucktail. In Massachusetts, the minimum is 12 inches, and this fish measured in at 13. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe. Thanks.